YouTube, what is going on? Back with my latest video. So today I have a mystery box, I guess you can say, from Wigs Figs. Make sure you check them out on Instagram. Very good friends of mine, dope YouTubers as well. So they sent over a box. I did um, buy some things. He actually saw some things in store for me, so I'm gonna show you guys as well. And I think he said he left a little bit of surprise in here that he won't be open on, on video and show you guys. And I also have a giveaway at the end of the video for you guys as well, so make sure you stay till the end for that. So let's get right to it, see what I got. Here we go. Listen, been in the game for a minute. Clocking in because it's time to get down to business. Starting is a habit, only I'm good at it. Ask around town, I'm known as the pop savage. Alright guys, before we get into this video, please smash that like button down below. Let me know you guys are enjoying these videos. And as always, if you're new to this channel, welcome and hit subscribe button down below as well so you're updated to my most recent content and hit that bell notification so you're alerted as soon as I post a new video. So like I said, I got a somewhat of a mystery box. Some things I do know, there's two purchases I made from him, maybe another one uh, from Charles from Wigs Figs. Um, so we'll see what's in here and I got to get my box cover. Box cutter, give me one second guys. All right guys, so let's open this up. So like I said, make sure you check them out on YouTube. Like I said, very good friends of mine and uh, dope YouTubers. And uh, definitely you know, show them support. They do a lot of giveaways as well. Uh, a lot of dope mystery boxes, uh, Pokemon cards, a lot of different things. So uh, definitely a cool channel to check out if you're not already subscribed. So let's see what I got in here. Um, I know there's some Pokemon cards in here, speaking of that. Okay, here we go. So let me show you guys what I got. All right, so first thing, I was able to pick up this Battle Styles Pokemon Elite Trainer box. So I haven't got um, any Battle Styles Elite Trainer boxes. I haven't found any of those in my area, so he hooked me with, up with this. Uh, very fortunate to get this. There is a blue one as well. Um, the red one's fine with me. I picked, he gave me a picture, and uh, I picked this one out. Uh, so hopefully this is the lucky one. Um, I do have a second channel if you guys are not aware. It's called Savage Breaks. There's a link in the description below where I do open up Pokemon trading cards and sports as well. So if you're interested in those kinds of things, make sure you check out that channel. Uh, but there you guys go. My first uh, Elite Trainer box for Battle Styles. I do, if you guys watch the channel, know I collect sealed products like Elite Trainer boxes and booster boxes. So that's one I needed to have. So I'm gonna track on that blue one eventually. And then he got me another Elite Trainer box we got the Shining Fate one. So this one is a pretty dope set. I haven't really had too good of luck with Shining Fates yet, so hopefully that can change around soon. And uh, we can get pull at least one Shiny. I haven't gotten a single Shiny card yet from Shining Fates, which is pretty crazy. Uh, I know a lot of people looking for that Charizard, but I'm just looking at least for one single Shiny card. So um, let's see what else is in here. So, okay. So I'm not sure what this is. It's uh, bubble wrapped and in a box, it says enjoy, bro. So let's see. I'll show you guys what is in here. Oh, oh, okay. So we have Yzma from WonderCon. Wow, okay. So I, um, I slept through this, so I actually was asleep. I missed out on all the WonderCon releases, so I don't have any of them. Um, this is what actually was the only one I wanted was the Yzma uh, from Emperor's New Groove. I do have back there, I don't know if you can see it, the Yzma Chase. So this one's pretty, pretty dope. And uh, yeah, it's a really cool design. This is one I was excited about, um, but it was early. I feel like waking up, to be honest with you guys. So I'm really happy that you came through in the clutch and help provide this grail for me. You know, it's gonna definitely fit into the Disney collection. Um, I do have a Cusco, yeah. So the only one I don't have now is Kronk and Pacha. Um, I don't know why I haven't got Pacha yet, but definitely have to track that one down. And uh, very, very dope Yzma, but there is more in here. We have the Kronk as well. So um, this is actually pretty crazy because I did not realize until right now that this was not a two pack. So. Funko has been doing that a lot recently where they've shown two pops that, you know, go together for like different cons and uh, it appears to be a two pack um, that those two mice from Hanna-Barbera, I forget their names, I do have them. Then there's that Luke and Leia. They both were like kind of marketed as two packs. And then when the drop happened, they're individual pops, which um, I don't really care one way or the other. I don't know why they just didn't make it a two pack. I think it would look cool as one. Um, but you know, regardless, it's the same price. It doesn't make much of a difference, but this set was very, very dope. Um, very cool scene from the movie. Growing up, um, this was kind of around when Disney kind of fell off. 
Um, they weren't past the like Renaissance era. Uh, I think the last movie that's technically the Renaissance was uh, Tarzan. And then after that, it wasn't really good, the best of movies, um, based on my opinion. Uh, the only ones that were really good around that time were Lilo and Stitch and Emperor's New Groove. I know some people like, like Chicken Little and all that, Meet the Robinsons, but um, I guess I was older at that point, didn't really watch him. But Emperor's New Groove was pretty, pretty funny to me. And uh, I think there's a TV show for it as well that I remember, and I remember that being good as well. Um, kind of featured the Kronk, and I think there's Kronk's new groove was a movie or TV show as well. Um, but yeah, these two, very, very dope. Uh, very funny Disney characters. Uh, to me, it's an underrated movie. Not a lot of people love that one. Um, people seem to love Yzma because they keep making Yzma pops. So there you guys go. Um, I really appreciate them for sending this over. Make sure you check out Wigs Figs. Like I said, two dope people. Um, you know, really happy that I met them through Funko. So uh, it's really, really crazy. The friends you can meet in this community and uh, really hooked me up with these. So I, I really do appreciate that. I was not expecting that. So uh, very, very cool pops and they will fit right in the collection as you guys know. So thanks so much. I got some Pokemon cards to open and, and collect and some Funko pops. I am a very happy person. So um, in the spirit of giving, I am going to be giving away a Funko pop to you guys as well. So. Uh, I did a chase roulette recently for this pop and I told you guys it was for my friend. He had a couple extra uh, common pops so he decided to give one to me to give away to you guys. So definitely shout out to him for doing that. So we have the Hades Hot Topic common right here. Um, somebody did tell me this one glows in the dark as well. I haven't checked out the glow but it's a very very cool pop. I have one for my collection already so I'm going to be giving this away to a random commenter down below. Um, what I'm going to do is drop down in the comment section below what your favorite Pokemon is. If you don't like Pokemon, just write Pokemon. <laughs> You're still entered and a random commenter will win this Hades Funko Pop. Um, as always, you got 24 hours to claim your prize. If you're domestic, I will ship it to you for free. If you're international, if you cover the shipping, I will ship it out to you as well. So there you guys go. If you want a chance to win this Hades, drop down your favorite Pokemon in the comment section below or drop Pokemon if you're not a fan. So uh, thanks again to Wigsface for making this video possible. Um, like I said, I do have a second channel where I'm going to be opening Pokemon stuff, so check that out. Uh, I probably will try to do a giveaway on there as well pretty soon once we build up the subscribers. Uh, I think we're getting close to 500, so maybe we do 500 subscribers. I'll give away something on there as well, either Pokemon or sports cards. So um, let me know if that's something you guys would be interested in as well. So thanks so much for watching, guys. As always, make sure you like this video, comment, share, and subscribe if you're new. And check me out my Instagram at the Pop Savage. You can stay connected on there as well. Thanks again, and until next time, I'll see you later.